the fastest and easiest way to complete collections, get the best cards in the game. And they'll be the show 23 stubs U4GM. Link is in the description. Let's go. What's going on, everybody? Today, we're going to be going over three tips to make you a better hitter overnight. Okay. Tip number one try to focus on the pitcher's cap. Every pitcher has a cap on his head. If you follow the cap, all the way through the windup and then you go a little bit to the outside of it at the release that will help you pinpoint where the ball is going and landing okay hit tip number one follow the cap on the pitcher's head that will help you get better PCI movement you want to do slow movements okay if the ball is coming to you super fast and low it's probably going to be in the dirt Okay, so we're going to be slowing these down. I'm watching the cap and then off the cap, barely a little, you can see the release coming out of his hand. Okay, from there, you can decide two things. Is it high or is it low? Okay, there's also, there's also a shadow underneath the ball before it's time for you to swing. But that's going to be a little more difficult to pick up in game. Okay, so follow the brim of the pitcher so right here he's turning there's his hat and you're gonna go a little bit to the outside if you do that practice that 10 minutes a day is gonna help you recognize the ball where it's released at a hundred times easier okay now tip number two cut the plate in half so if you are one of the ones that swings at everything sliders inside outside pitches high pitches dirt pitches make it easier on yourself by using tip number two cutting the plate in half so you can see every pitcher is centered in the middle okay so if you have a left-handed better you're gonna cut it in half on the first two pitches you don't want anything to the left of the pitcher no matter where he releases it you want everything straight down the middle and close to you on the first two pitches so you can see right there on the 0 and 2 pitch I picked up two tendencies what my pitcher was doing and then I was able to slowly move the PCI a little bit to the outside so you can see it's 0-2 I'm watching the brim I then picked up on a couple pitches already and boom I can see the ball is a little bit to the outside dropping down for a perfect perfect swing Okay, you don't want to jam your PCI no matter if you miss the ball or not. You want to practice slow PCI movements every single time. You have more time than what you expect to be able to reach the pitches. Okay, when you jam the PCI, they're not going to reward you. When you slowly move the PCI, you're going to get more rewarded. Tip number one, tip number two, tip number three, make sure that you are always patient. The fastest and easiest way to complete collections, get the best cards in the game. And they'll be the show 23 stubs, U4GM. Link is in the description. Let's go.